All right, we're gonna answer some questions today about the music industry because I know you're a star that's up and coming. A lot of people are starting to mention your name. Your name is buzzing out there. But what I want to know is you just recently released a new song. Mm -hmm. What makes this Jasmine Sullivan performance for you a must watch, especially as a fellow musician? I mean, Jasmine Sullivan, I feel like is the vocal bible for R&B and soul music. Mm. I, I feel like she's so needed, you know, right now. Um, vocally, she's just amazing. She's unmatched, you know. Mm -hmm. So I am, as an artist, trying to tap into that 90s, that 2000s um, R&B music that tells a story and has a lot of passion, a lot of soul, and she is that. So when you watch somebody like Jasmine, are you watching like as a fan, but then are you watching as like an artist, like you're taking Girl, notes? Girl, I was fanning and out. <laughs> I was taking all the words. I love Jasmine Sullivan. What impact has social media made on just even the distribution for new artists like yourself to put your music out there and different for seasoned artists like Jasmine to already have like a following too? I think it's an amazing platform. Mm -hmm. I feel like with social media, things are changing. The landscape is changing so much. As an independent artist, you can really make it yourself. Mm -hmm. You know, you got to find your lane and just continue on your journey. But it, it really opened up doors for a lot of people mm -hmm. where you don't necessarily need a record label. You can kind of put yourself out there. So how important is having your smartphone by you for your career. How much does your phone play into your It's my your life, it's my life. My <laughs> husband and my daughter tell me, get off the phone. I'm like, I'm working, you know? From my social media to my calendar to emails to distributing my music to send it. I mean, just, it's everything. Mm -hmm. I use it for everything. I love it. Well, I can't wait to hear some more new music Thank from you. I see you on Instagram and your daughter is beautiful. Thank your family you. is beautiful. Thank you, so Thank you so much for sitting with Thank us. Thank you for having me. Coming up next, we have another new artist. Her name is Paula DeAnda, so you guys stay tuned right here at the Cricket Lounge. Thank you, Colleen. Thank you. We just had the beautiful Colleen Crozo hanging out with us, and now we got Miss Paula DeAnda sitting down with us. Paula, I, I feel like I kind of know you because we've hung out a couple of times we here have, in the Cricket I, Lounge. We have definitely run into each other a lot here. We and have. It's amazing, the environment today. I mean, <sighs> Jasmine. Like, Jasmine <laughs> Sullivan, right? So you've been a successful songwriter for a very long time. What makes seeing a Jasmine Sullivan performance so important for you and a, just a must-watch for everybody out there? Oh, I think Jasmine is just amazing because, you know, when she was speaking, she was telling us her story mm -hmm. and how deep it is for her, her compassion, everything, like, her, everything comes out in her singing. Like, you said you wanted to cry. I was almost in tears. <laughs> I'm, I'm still like this. Like, I was ah! like, I didn't wear waterproof today. <laughs> this is not good for me right now. Yes, you can feel it. It's, it's, her heart is in her music. So. I love it. Well, thank you so much for being thank here. You. Thanks for always kicking it. She's like my go-to. I look at her, I'm like, does my outfit look okay? Do I have lipstick on my teeth? These pants. She always has my back. I appreciate <laughs> yeah. you for hanging out with thank me, guys. Thanks and well, for having me. There you have it, fans. All right, thanks so much for watching and letting us give you something to smile about. Don't forget to follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram to stay updated on our next live from Cricket Lounge performance. Until then, take care. <laughs>